If you are getting tired of getting a fingerprint no match every time you try to unlock your phone, here is a simple trick how you can try to get it to read your fingerprints every single time. Now first, what you want to do is go into your phone and go down and go into settings. In the settings screen, go to biometrics and security and then tap on fingerprints. I'm going to put in the phone pin to uh, go into fingerprints and I'm just going to remove my old fingerprint. Now the trick is when you are registering for a new fingerprint, you want to hold the phone the way how you unlock it. So normally you would unlock your phone on the side holding the phone this way and your thumb would be like kind of like sideways or at a very slight angle, not typically like this. So when you're registering your phone or your fingerprint to the phone, you may hold the phone like this. But when you are unlocking your phone, you typically holding it this side. So you want to register your fingerprint the way how you hold your phone to unlock it. So if you normally hold your phone like this, then this is how you should be uh, scanning your uh, fingerprint. Now also take note that every time you scan for a fingerprint, it will take 16 scans. So as you can see here, it will take 16 scans. So I'm going to scan it 16 times. And I'll give you some more info uh, shortly. So I'm just going to scan it first. So now that it is um, scanned 16 times, so the phone has been recorded 16 different fingerprints into the database. So every time I try to unlock my phone, like so, it will basically scan against the 16 records and once it finds a match, it will unlock the phone. So now we go back into fingerprints and what you want to do is to register another fingerprint with the same thumb or the same finger that you're using. So I'm going to tap on add fingerprint. Now this time, instead of um, scanning my thumb the way how I hold my phone, I'm going to scan it this way. So because every time we register a new fingerprint, it's scanned 16 times. So I want to try to do uh, scan my my thumb at all different angles. So I'm going to scan it on the left hand side first, once, and then do it two times. And then I'm going to try it at this angle at the top. So one, two, then I try at the center. So one, two, so that's six times already. Now I go to the right hand side a little bit. So one, two, and then three, four, five, six. So I have a few more left. So I'm just going to scan up the top. So I'm going to tap on continued and then I try to do it at this angle. Then try to do it at a different angle, this angle. And that's it. So now we done the scanning at all the different angles. So whenever we try to scan to unlock our phone, uh, sometimes you're not going to be, you know, always uh, at the same angle. So you want to make sure you cover all the different angles from the left to the right to the center. So that every time when we try to scan, it's always going to work every time. So yours, when you press on the, uh, the ultrasonic fingerprints, make sure that you also press it quite hard. If you do it very gentle, it might not work. You can see it says press a little bit harder. So you need to use a bit of pressure to push down a little bit to unlock it. Now, if you take notice, I will try to unlock it at all the different angles. You can see if I can try to do it center here, it will work. If I try to do a little bit to the left, it will work. If I try to do a bit to the right, it will work. And if I try to do it flat, so that one there, it does not work. So because I didn't kind of press hard, hard enough, I guess. So there it is. So that's pretty good. Um, holding it with one hand. So let's see what we hold it with one hand. There it is. So you can see the accuracy is very good. Uh, giving that, um, you know, I only reaches that two times. There it is. So that's how you can improve your fingerprint scan. Now we have 30, um, 32 scans uh, on the phone. And given that only 32 scan, it isn't going to slow down your phone because your phone is equipped with a very powerful CPU inside. So it can scan through the, um, the 32 records very quickly and it can unlock your phone quite fast, even with, you know, if you have three uh, fingerprints register. 
Now, if you want to uh, also improve the speed, you want to um, go into settings, so tap on the settings icon, and go down all the way down to um, um, developer options. So I haven't got developer options here. So what I do is I'm going to go into the search icon here and tap on in animations. So reduce animations. So it's not in here. It's not. So it's not in that section. So I'm just going to try to enable developer options. So I'm going to go down and tap on about font. And I'm going to go into software update, not sorry, about font, and then um, software information, and then build number. So I'm just going to um, activate developer options. So I'm not sure what's that. So I need to put in a pin to activate developer options now. So I'm just going to put in a pin. So now developer, developer mod has been enabled. What I'm going to do is go back here and then go into developer options. And we go down to animations. So I'm, because there is such a lot, large uh, number of items. So I'm just going to try to do a search in here. So here it is, so developer options, uh, animator dur duration scale. So I'm just going to tap on that to go down to that sections. And we're going to turn off all this uh, transition animation scale. I can even uh, turn it off or lower it down. So I'm just going to switch it off. Uh, you can also switch off Windows animations. So all of this, I'm just going to switch it off to make it faster when I uh, unlock the phone. So you may not notice because the phone is quite fast already, but uh, when you turn off uh, animations, it, it can improve the speed uh, of your phone. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel for more videos.